welcome back to the channel we are closing in on 3,000 subscribers honestly I cannot thank you guys enough people are always hitting me up in the comments they're always saying been here since 10 subs or been here since 100 subs honestly the thank you goes out to all of you guys honestly for the people that hit the subscribe button thank you so much so in today's video as you can see from the thumbnail it says hidden locations so yes we're gonna be showcasing some rare hidden locations some of you guys may know about some of them but the glitching community is so big once you learn a new glitch you forget about the next one so overall i hope you guys do enjoy the video don't forget to support this video with a big big like honestly it would make my day just hit that like button let's hop right into it now first thing first i would like to start off by saying every location that i do showcase in today's video is completely solo but i recommend using a friend because it'll only be better and much faster now if you're gonna use a friend you're gonna need one more item which is completely free which is known as the fire truck now if you don't know how to get the fire truck at your location all you're gonna want to do is pull up your phone go to context press x if you're on the xbox one and dial 911 from that point someone should answer and then they're gonna give you a couple of choices just pick the fire department from that point the fire truck should show up okay now first First up, I'm gonna be showing you guys how to breach inside the Eclipse Tower building, leading you to a secret little garage where you can camp out, bring your friends inside, and just chill. Honestly, once you get inside and look around, it is kind of small, but like I said, you can use this for a lot of reasons. Whether you want to get your friends inside and just chill out, if you got like a huge bounty on you and everyone in the lobby is trying to attack you, this is like a great tactic just to get away from everyone and sit that bounty out. Now, in order to perform this glitch correctly, you're gonna need two people, like I said, from jump. You're gonna need someone inside the fire truck driving it and you're gonna need somebody in the back now the person that's gonna be on the back is gonna be the one getting raw breached inside all you're gonna need to do is literally line the fire truck up with the garage have someone driving it he's gonna bag the fire truck as fast as he can into the garage now this may take a couple of tries but you'll definitely know when you get it because your body will be forced through the gate although you don't have that much space to actually work with but being able to be inside of here get some crazy snapmatics or even just get some friends in here it's amazing now as always I'm gonna drop the location but once again it's at the Eclipse Towers I'm pretty sure everyone knows where the Eclipse Towers is. Now, once you get here, remember, you're going to need an extra friend and you're going to need that fire truck. Once you get those, you'll be able to knock this out in no time. Although this may take a couple of tries, but once you do get it, just use some improvising and you'll be able to figure out what you want to do with this little wall breach. Next up, we're going to be using the same fire truck tactic, but we're going to be breaching inside the shelter that's attached to this trailer home. And honestly, when you get inside of here, I honestly don't have an explanation for anything. All I know is that when I'm inside, I see a wall that's filled with tools and then I see a shelf that has like these radiation looking type weird ass things although it is incredibly cool being inside I love blue now there is another way of getting inside of here although I just took this route because I feel like it's easier but if you want to do it solo all you have to do is literally stand on top of the roof and then just start up a Martin job once it fully loads in just back out and sometimes this works but most of the time it does not so that's why I decided to take this route and have someone ram me inside so I'll be able to know for a fact that I'll breach inside here goes that location now I will know one thing for this certain location once you get to this spot there's gonna be multiple trailer homes just remember to look for the one that says peace on it and it has a lot of color to it so overall an amazing hidden location the only downfall is in order to get out of this location you have to kill yourself in order to get out but other than that an amazing hidden location with all that being said let's hop into the next one now next up this hidden location is probably by far my most favorite because of the fact that you have so much space to do whatever you want and let alone a little trick that I love doing is starting up the most wanted challenge and if you're gonna do the most wanted challenge meaning you're gonna have a lot of cops coming after you as well as cop helicopters then you're gonna need to be guarded and being inside of here doing the most wanted challenge is probably your best bet now it is very easy to breach inside of here all you're gonna need is a fire truck and an extra person from this point you're gonna want to go through the double doors they're gonna just open automatically or you can just take a gun and shoot them from that point you're gonna want to walk to the next double doors now this is where you're gonna stand completely close to them from this point you're gonna want to have the person that's driving the fire truck he's gonna slowly ram you against the glass now once he rams you you're gonna to drop to the ground you're gonna sit there for a few seconds and then you should glitch inside and like I said you have incredible space to do whatever you want and your best bet is to get as many people as you can inside of there get them all into your VIP or CEO and do the most wanted challenge because no one can shoot you from the outside now there goes the location and yes you're gonna need an extra person and yes you're gonna need that fire truck so once you do get those two items then just make your way here now next up this is actually 
actually a wall bridge glitch that was found by me. I don't know what the hell I was doing. I accidentally just got on top of a huge ass truck and then I ended up pressing the jump button and somehow I just magically wall bridged through. But in order to perform this glitch correctly, you're gonna need a huge box truck. I prefer the mule, but whatever sits high. Once you get a mule and you bring it over here, you're gonna wanna park it exactly how we have it. From this point, you're just gonna wanna get on top of the mule. Once you get on top of the mule, then you're just gonna wanna be facing the garage. And once you're facing the garage, then you're just gonna wanna hit the jump button one more time. This is gonna bring you through the garage on top of this top layer. I'm not quite sure what it is, but all I know is that I definitely use it to my advantage as well as my friend. And we would all come here and gather up. We would hide out from bounties. And as you can see from this footage right here, we were doing the most wanted challenge. Honestly, it went swell. No one could shoot inside. We didn't even have to shoot out. We decided to shoot just for the enjoyment. And the fact that you can just get inside alone is just incredible. Completely solo. You don't need anyone, but just getting friends over here would be so much better. Now, here goes that location. And FYI, a couple of you guys actually may own this garage where wall breached in the reason I bought it was the fact that I just didn't want it to make it seem like I was coming all the way out here just for a wall breach that's why I decided to buy the garage but like I said a couple of you guys may actually own this garage and that all about wrap it up for today's video hope you guys did enjoy those are a couple of hidden locations that you guys can definitely go check out now if the ratings do good for this video I definitely will make a series out of this where I at least upload one hidden location video a week hopefully you guys do enjoy that with all that being said if you made it this far and you leave likes normally and you leave a beautiful comment thank you so much for the people that don't do that let's change come on now leave a beautiful comment and leave a like now we're gonna have a crew opening to join my crew and if you guys are interested let me know in the comments remember leave a like on this video thank you guys so much for your support it's been real i'll be seeing you guys real soon